fashion, there's, um, there's a frozen sphere that the alien ship puts out. Right here, what that does is it freezes everything within, so all this jungle is frozen in there. So that's Act 2 of play. So you work your way inside that, okay? And then you eventually work your way into the alien ship itself, which becomes zero G. So you have 360 degrees of freedom flying around you on the fly. So I can switch to a silencer, grenade launcher, flashlight, different types of ammo depending on the situation. In addition to that, I have a high-tech suit that I'm wearing, so I can switch to more speed, more strength, and more armor, depending on what I need at the time. That means uh, if I switch to more speed, I will, will that decrease any other value of the, of the armor? It, everything's based off of uh, center, right? So it will, it will actually change it, but it maximizes that bit, right? So you will sacrifice a little bit of like defense. You will sacrifice a little bit, you know, it's all, it's all about really getting the enhancements going on. There's a guy there. Boom! And he's calling his troops because he saw... He saw his guy get killed. He saw him swing the thing. He's like, you know, come over here. There's another guy at the top. He's actually coming down to help you out. This guy's ultra intelligent. You really have to be careful about what you do because everything has consequences. Yeah, that's how it's done. Yeah. These guys are going to try and sneak up on you. They'll try and flank around you. If they think they're outnumbered, they'll run away. They try and regroup. If you think they have numbers, they're going to just come at you. Yeah, one of them just hit it somewhere around there. Pardon? Where is 
left as I can pick up. I'm trying to make my way to the deck.